Holy shit. Maybe I should brush my hair. Soon. Okay, um, hold on. Hey guys, what's up? I'm like, I'm not, like, I'm so sick of complaining, but like, it is what it is right now. I'm not like kind of person that complains, but I'm just like so fucking sick. Um, like I'm nauseous all the time. I just took off my C-bands because I took a shower. Um, I should put them back on. Okay, they're like ingrained. Um, okay, um, so what is up? Okay, so today, I, if you guys follow me on Instagram, I showed my, um, record player and it's really, really cool. I wanted to show you guys because, um, look at this cross. I did a new launch so you guys know, um, yesterday and you should go check it out. This cross is so cool. Look at how gorgeous the crystal is and they're on all sides. Comes in gold and silver. This is my flicker chain. Comes in gold and silver too. And this is my um duchess chain it's 14k gold filled and what i love about it is you can attach it anywhere it's 18 inches i have it done tightly um so you can wear it as a lariat like you can put it attach it different places um and the quality is like really good because it's uh 14k gold filled and i also have um it in sil sterling silver if you want but i'm just wearing it as like a high choker you can also put like um charms on it and stuff like that but I could do that for you too if you like any of my pendants or charms. I'm out of breath. Pendants or charms, I can do that for you too on that chain. Um, I look like a, an 80s rock star with his hair. Like, stop. Okay. Stop. Um, anyway, I'm so out of fucking breath. Okay. Um, I'm gross. I'm disgusting. And I. So, okay. I'm going to take you to my other room. Which, by the way, did you guys see how I put all, like, wallpaper in there? Biggest mistake of my fucking life. Is that? Oh, wow. Look at that. I literally, like, I don't know what. Where, like, the makeup went. Okay, so. I'm a mess. I, I can't, you guys. I'm so sick. I'm constantly nauseous. Like, it's so gross. Okay. Um, I, Sorry. I could just like fall asleep. <laughs> okay. I wallpapered this room. I'll show you guys. You remember that little the vibe room? Okay. Well, I wallpapered it because I see everyone on like Instagram and like TikTok and they have like these cute, like cozy rooms with um like wallpaper. And I'm like, oh, that's like such a cute idea just for like one room to have like just a couple walls wallpapered for like a cozy feel. Cause you guys know like this house is very like hacienda french country like it's more cozy because the last house was just like palatial sterile right and i wanted to get away from that so badly so i thought let's do that let's wallpaper a fucking room so i bought this wallpaper and i liked it when it came oh these are also my serpent earrings i love them they're my mini stacking serpents and you can either get them without pave or with pave with crystal emerald eyes and please do not be afraid to fucking mix metals. Like I didn't show in, in my pictures, like on the site, I only show gold together because I know you guys don't mix metals, but please do. Because look, I do mix metals. It's the best. This is my ugly side. Um, this, see, there's two silver and one gold. It's so cool. Like I just do this because I know you, I know what you guys would typically buy. So, but I promise you get mixed metals. It's so pretty. Okay. It doesn't matter, but I'm just trying to help you. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> So I bought this wallpaper. Thank God it wasn't a lot. It wasn't like a crazy amount of money because wallpaper can get so expensive. Like there's like designer wallpaper that is like thousands of dollars. Like it's actually insane. Okay. And like, how are you a thousand percent sure? Because once you put up a wall, like anyway, you guys, I bought the wallpaper. I had it installed. Like I didn't do it myself. I paid for it to be installed. And when he put it up, I was kind of like, not sure it wasn't like, you know, uh, not his fault. Like, m like the fact that the wall, I didn't love the wallpaper. And I was like, no, like it's pretty dude. As the days went on and as my nausea got worse, 
if I even think about wallpaper, I will literally like, I can just feel my entire, like I just, I get like seasick. I get literally seasick, hungover seasick. So I'm not throwing up nausea, I'm just seasick. I'm car sick and hungover 24 seven. Like that's what this is. So I could not deal with that. Like I, that wallpaper was ruining my life where I literally just hired someone to come and like rip it down and it destroyed the wall. So now it has like, whatever. <sighs> they made it as smooth as they can. Now, because my walls are like, they're like, my walls are kind of shiny. They're like not matte, which I love because I don't like the matte wall. I love my house, how it's like, forget what it's, it's almost like a satin, but it's different too. It's like a satin with a brush over it. I can't, I don't know what it is. I forget. They have to come and finish the wall. Anyway, it's white right now. Thank God they got it taken down. Like I, it was ruining my life. Like honestly, it was ruining my life. It's so ugly. So, so I couldn't even go in there. Okay. So anyway, um, let me tell you guys. Okay. So on my Insta, I'm really ugly today. Like, I'm sorry. I just am like, this is also, let me show you like my, actually I do want to show you guys this. I know you're going to like be like, this disgusting. I also want to show you guys something I bought. Okay. So I know I look like a fat pig. Like I don't care. Okay. So let me just show you. I bought this from H&M. These are for men. This is like a men's jacket. So what I do is this. Because, like, I'm not that fat. You see what I mean? Like, so if you kind of, like, just do that, it's, like, wait, this is up. That's a problem. It's kind of, like, cute. Like, you see what I mean? Like, where it's just, like, a vibe. Like, you just kind of have it open. But the problem is, if you had it zipped the whole way, then you kind of be, like, hmm, like, is she fat? Like, is that the size of her? Do you see what I mean? But then, if you, this is the double X. This is the biggest one they have. Then if you do this, it's, like, oh, okay. Like, yeah, she's not the skinniest, but, like, she doesn't have a gut. Like, you know what I mean? By the way, I think today, like, I think I am showing a tiny bit. Like, I'm not showing yet, but I saw my stomach. Unless I'm just a fat cow, which yes, I am. Okay, yes, I am fat. Because I have to eat to not feel like I'm going, to, like, I have to eat to feel like I'm not dying. Like, with car sick. Because it's the only thing that, like, stops it is that. And then, but the thing is that all food makes me sick. So, I stop it for a while by eating something, but then the moment I'm done eating, that food made me sick. So I don't, it's, you guys, it's horrible. And things like sour candy and stuff work too, but that's fattening. Like, you guys, it's just not good. It's not good. I'm gonna, I'm praying this just ends soon so that I can just kind of manage, you know what I mean, weight, weight wise. Okay, so let me show you guys. I'm gonna show you guys my turntable. I also am gonna show you guys something else. I have like so many things to show you. Okay, let's go. Um, okay. I got my couch. I absolutely love it. Um, I waited since July to have it, to have it like, okay. And by the way, I hate furniture. Furniture is like the absolute worst because it's such a crapshoot and like, you can't return it. It's a non-returnable item, which I don't understand how it's non-returnable. It's something like that this big of a, so, look at, I look like a, I look, okay. Yes, I do. I admit that I look disgusting today, but you guys are lucky that I'm even able to like do this right now. Okay. So... I don't understand these companies. I get it because furniture is hard. Like this is actually perfect. Don't look at that with this TV, the fucking, of course, the direct TV box is fucked up. So um, it's perfect. I fucking love it so much. Like the size, everything about it. So anyway, it worked out, but all right, let me show you guys what I bought. Oh my God. Okay. So you guys know I hate all things designer. Yes, I do. Designer is disgusting. It's ghetto and it's very male lady. Yes, it is. Okay. It is. I don't wear like, I just don't, I just don't. Okay. But I bought something that I fucking love and yes, I bought it for me. I did not buy it for her. I bought it for myself. Okay. Let me show you what I purchased and people on my subscriptions would know. Wait, let me just set it up properly. Yeah, is this like not? Okay, you ready? Okay, look what I bought. I bought it after, um, oh wow, what a pig. Okay, I bought it after my, I heard the heartbeat, like the real heartbeat. And this is definitely a splurge. It's the Dior um, pram stroller. Um, I love it, isn't it cute? Like you guys, I just feel like I need it because I just, I okay, <laughs> you know what's funny too? I saw like on TikTok, like moms were like, 
We judge by strollers. Okay, bitch, you and your bugaboo. Um, no. Um, I just have to do our stroller. Like, we're not even competing over here. Like, different. Um, and no, we don't talk to other moms. Like, I'm not, I'm not a social mother. I'm not going to social. My child better not be social. Like, if he's, if she's like Jason, like, I'm so motherfucked. Okay. Um, so. Oh, shit. This is the stroller. Do we love it? Okay. Honestly, I, this is giving, like, fat Alex, like, like, five or six years ago. Stop. Like, I'm going to change. I'm going to change because this is not representative. I'm really not that fat. Like, you guys, look, I'm not. Okay, stop I'm fucking freaking out. Okay, so look at this. I look like I look so ugly. I can't. Like, I'm gonna delete this video. Oh wow, I'm gonna delete this video. Okay, so this is the stroller. Cute. Okay, love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. So cute. Okay, stroller. Um, and I hate designer things, so I think I just I do love you guys. I don't know if you know. I do love the Dior print. I love it. Um, it's very classic, but. Okay, so let's go over to the turntable now. Okay, so we are in the vibe room right now and nothing is permanent. This is all stuff that I want in here, but like nothing goes yet. I don't have a proper console table or anything, but I got this um, Murano glass mirror, which I do love and want in here. And I love this lamp, but it's all just literally sitting here because I don't have a table yet. And then I have the bassinet because I want the bassinet to just be something that we use like when we're downstairs, you know what I mean? I don't know if that's a thing, like, I don't know. I just don't want, it's not the crib. Like I would keep this in here or like in the living room or something. I don't even know how it works, but that's the plan. And then, um, okay, so let me tell you guys about the, okay, so um, my, let me tell you guys about this turntable. I never really wanted a turntable. Like I know a lot of people on TikTok have them and they buy records. Records, like I, I, I understand like the, like the sound, like people like the sound and stuff, but that's not why I got them. I have a lot of old, my like great grandma's old, people like walk and they like talk loud. Okay. Um, okay, so these are like her, her records from like the 20s, 30s, and 40s. And I have, or my dad has all of, like a lot of them. But like to be able to play a record like in from this time period, you need those like ugly record players with like the horn or like in the big box. Like you guys can, you guys see them at like thrift stores, which don't usually work. Or you can get them like, like fixed up. Like they have them at like flea markets and stuff, but they're ugly. Like they're ugly and I, I've always loved the, you guys know I love like old music and I'm like definitely think I'm an old soul. Um, and the fact that there's, these are her records, it's just really interesting to me. So I had like this wild hair up my ass, as they say, to like be able to get the records and like play them properly. But I wanted a, I wanted a modern looking, um, I wanted a modern record player. So I, this is the project. I don't know, like it's a nice record player. I'm not sure. This is the one I wanted. So this is the record player and this is the speaker. Okay, so this is how it plays. And I like this setup. Um, I know a lot of you guys yesterday were asking, how do you like, because it, it was, this is my third record player. I ordered two incorrect. Actually, the first one I ordered was right, okay? I returned it because I thought it was wrong. Um, I want to be able to play basically all records, all speeds, and I want to be able to play these antique ones, okay? Because I don't want like several different units. I want everything to be able, whatever. So I was reading articles online by Project um, and they were saying, yes, like you are able to do that. You just need to get, it was really complicated. So in the end, I went on to Project's like website and I found some people in the area who de who are their dealers. It was complicated, okay? So I found someone, he ordered it for me, he got it in, I brought my record, my grand, my great grandmother's records in, and it was playing like wonky, like wah, 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 like like um spooky, like right? it was wrong. So he's like, that shouldn't do that. And I was like nervous because I was so nervous to pay him the money because I wrote him back like five or six times. I was like, 
did you read the article I sent you? I will pay you, you know, I want to go through with this, but I want to, you understand, I want to be able to play records from the seventies, new records, like all the speeds and the antique ones. So this is what they say we need. Are, is this the right one? Blah, blah. He's like, yes, 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 yes. So I just paid it because I was like, I don't know how else to do this. I paid his invoice. So I paid it. Anyway, go in, the record doesn't work. So he's like, okay, I think we just need a new band. And I was like, I'm not confident because I just wasn't confident, but it ended up working. So then a couple weeks later, he got the band in. It's a, just a band and it's a different needle. That's all it is. Um, so if you guys have like your grandmother's vintage old record player or records and you want to do this, um, you can do it, but you should find like I did like a professional in your area who will get you the proper unit and like make sure it works. Okay. So I am so stoked. You guys, I'm going to play it for you. It is so cool. What the cooler thing is about this is you can buy this song. For example, you can buy, um, music from the 1920s on new records, right? It's not the same. These are the same way that people in the 1920s heard the music. Like it's a time machine. We are living like, it's the coolest thing to me. Like this is exactly how they were listening to the music. This is the same music they listened to. And you guys know, I have like a lot, very like big love for like history and especially like, um, art deco period and stuff. So I'm really happy this worked out. I have so many records to listen to. I actually do love this song. I'm gonna buy some more records, the Trollo records, like actual ones are expensive, especially if they're not like hundred and something dollars for one song. Cause there's only one song on, on, on a record, on one side of a record. Um, but there's like some songs that I like just really love that I'm gonna be buying, purchasing, but I'm gonna get the original records, not like the new records. Cause that's not, these, this is how they listen. This is, do you understand? Like I don't, they listen to these records or this, it's the same, song it's the same I, do you understand what i'm saying like if you were to buy the new records it's yeah it's the same song but that's not the probably this it's not the same do you, do you get what i mean okay <laughs> so let's turn it on it takes a second to um <laughs> I'm so emotional. I love it so much. So cool. love it so much I just feel like it's such a like um it's a part of history like I don't I don't know I'm really I'm really sentiment like I'm actually not that sentimental I but I do there are certain things where I don't know I like mad respect I guess is the word I don't know I what is the word I'm I know I'm emotional too because I'm pregnant but I get like this with music you guys know I do like I get like this with certain songs and event like I don't know I just do but I'm I'm stoked. I love this. I also did buy like um I'll show you. Let me get you, oh I'll show you guys this. It's pretty cool. 
So my dad is like so protective over his stuff. He'll like never let me borrow anything. But because I was like, he's always wanted to like hear his grandma's like, whatever. He, he wanted to hear his grandma's like songs or whatever his music. So I was able to do this. And because I was able to do that, he let me borrow one of his, one of his, his, um, what's it called? So this is the original Beach Boys like album. Um, God Only Knows is on that song. You know, that's like mine and Jason's song. And you know, I love the Beach Boys. So this is his record, like the original record. I also bought Lana, of course. And Mao loves when I put Lana records on. It is the weirdest thing. He, um, what's the song? His song is the um, Light, Let the Light In. Oh my gosh. He'll run over. He'll run over and like try to get, he loves it. Um, I also, yeah, so I bought two other Lanas. Um, love them so much. And then there's another Beach Boy one my dad let me borrow. And then, um, I don't, I didn't show you guys that because this is one that I keep to, I don't want anyone to know, even though you just saw it because, um, I do gatekeep. Yes, I do a hundred percent gatekeep. Um, you're going to ruin the vibe. Okay. Yes, you are. You're going to ruin the vibe. And you're going to just like play music that you don't understand. Stupid. Okay. So you don't get to know, but maybe I will show you. I think I showed my people on subscriptions this. Um, this one, but you wouldn't know the song anyway because you're dumb, so it doesn't even matter that you saw the artist. Um, anyway, but this is like one where I showed you, like this one, is one where I should get the original one from her time period. Um, that would be sick. Actually, I probably will. So that's that. Um, I hope you guys like this. And um, I'm not, I'll just show you guys the. So this is. This lamp is really pretty at night. I love it. So I purchased this. This is a big Murano um, Venetian glass mirror. Um, and it, I purchased it at like this antique store and they had this lamp in front of it on like a high table, the buffet, right? And it was just so pretty because the reflection, this color at night, it's like this peachy light pink. It's so pretty. So I went back and bought the lamp too because I just loved, I was like, I love this mirror, but like that lamp was just so pretty next to it. So, um, I love the contrast of the, like, new modern, you know, with old, and, um, to be honest, I love the bassinet, but I don't like the skirt, but it's the uh, skirt, I don't know, it's a skirt that goes with it, but it's kind of ugly, like, I even ironed it, and it's still just, like, ugly, it's just, I don't know, it looked way prettier online, but whatever, um, okay, so the last thing before I go, um, is this i went and got this this morning actually <laughs> jason got it for me before he left to work um let me okay so he's the best he's so helpful he's just so nice okay i don't look so disgusting here um all right so i want to show you guys a trick i you guys know i've been eating these bean burritos like crazy but even what i'll do sometimes I'm, i'll be so sick where i'll just drive through and i'll have a couple bites and i'll just throw the rest away because these bean burritos are fucking fattening. They're like 350 calories, like just for one. I get it now with no cheese. And then I, what I do, this is so disgusting, but I just squeeze out. Well, now it's like fucking hard. Fuck. It's like been sitting. Um, I squeeze out all the beans, which now I can't because it's like hard. Oh my God, I'm so disgusting. Well, that didn't work. There. I squeeze out all the beans because there's look at all this. This is all beans and like fat and lard, right? Like refried beans is so bad. So I just have like a flat. Like I don't need the beans. They actually make me like they do make me sick. It's the tortilla, I think, and some beans that helps. Like I don't need all this at all. Like I Okay, and when it's hotter, more comes out. But now it's like a flat. It's like a flat thing. Um, no cheese, no beans, no fresh. No cheese. Um, squeeze all the beans out. And then I have this like, I could get more out too, honestly. I just want to show you guys that if you're pregnant and you are doing this bean and cheese burrito like in 
like obsession like I am, this is the same. Like you don't need, let me show you how much I took out. And usually I can get more out too. Like this is a lot of beans. So it's like, but yesterday I got even more out because I, I should have done this when it was hot, but it's kind of been sitting. I can get some more out. Um, because these beans are like refried beans are so fattening. Like they're so fattening. It's just cooked in like lard or something, I think. Anyway. Mm. I'm gonna go after this. Um, I'm just like kind of feeling not the best today. I have um 